Well, good morning. Welcome back to GP Outdoors. Looks like we're in for a big thunderstorm today. About six and a half months ago, I got contacted by a company called Automatic Trap. And they contacted me to ask me if I'd be willing to try out one of their products, which is called the A24 Good Nature Rat and Mouse Trap. I agreed to do so, but a month after I started using it, I posted my first video on it, which you'll see here. And at the time, when I get the review on the trap, I told you folks it was the best mouse trap I had ever used. I've now been using it for six months consecutively, right through the winter. Why don't you grab a coffee and stick around, and I'll tell you what I think about it now. Cheers. So you may recall, when I first picked up this trap, and they sent me the information and the equipment, I'd asked them to send me a portable stand. And the reason why is because if I was going to test this equipment out, I wanted to test it in different locations, both indoors and outdoors, in order to see how effective it was. For six months, I've had this trap in garages, both heated and not heated. I've had it in workshops. I've had it in a greenhouse. I've had it in my crawl space, the basement. I've had it on the side of the cabin on the porch. I've had it on the sides of the cabin. I've put it in the shed. And I've also taken it down to the city, to my home. And I've used it in the garage there, as well as in the backyard around the barbecue. Areas where I see evidence of mice. It has gone for weeks at a time in the wintertime outside in cold temperatures as cold as negative 37 degrees Celsius. It's seen freezing rainstorms, it's seen snowstorms, and it's seen a lot of adverse weather conditions. If you recall back in January when I did my first review on this unit, I got rid of all of my poisons, my snap traps, um, the electronic devices that never worked that I spend way too much money on. And in addition to that, I also canceled my pest control service. I'm now on my third CO2 cartridge, and each cartridge will give you about 22 to 24 kills. I have, for the first time in eight years, not heard scratching, chewing, uh, fighting, or any type of activity in the walls, ceiling, or the attic of my cabin. So as you know, it's a rat and mouse trap, which means, as you can see, the opening into the chamber is pretty large. And it's large because, of course, rats are large. What I have learned over the last six months is that there are a lot of other smaller critters in the forest, ones that you don't want to target. And every once in a while, they've gotten curious and kind of snuck into the trap. So I gave my friends a call at Automatic Trap, and I explained that to them, and I asked them, was there some way of limiting the size of the little critter or rodent that could get into this trap? They said, absolutely, we've thought of that. And they just sent me an optional piece for this trap called a blocker. And basically the blocker works with your tree mount. Simply attach it to your tree mount, clip it on, screw it in, take your portable stand off, put the trap on top, and as you can see, it now limits the size of the mouse or the rodent that's able to get into the trap. So I'm pretty happy about that. So I'm going to hook up the blocker to this unit and I'm going to test it for another couple of months to see if it continues to be just as effective as it's been all winter. So while I hook up the new blocker, why don't you take a look at how effective the traps been. Simple, quick, she's on, the excluder's on, it's all connected. The reason I put it on a piece of wood is because once again as I go to test this over the coming months, I want to be able to move it to different locations. Otherwise I simply would have just screwed it to either a tree in the back by the shed or in the shed or where I want to put it permanently. Let's see how this thing does over the next couple of months. So after six months of continuous use, through adverse weather, indoors and outdoors, 
I can tell you that this is still to this day the best mouse trap I have ever used here at the cabin or down in the city. I hope it's been helpful for you. If you've enjoyed the channel, please click subscribe, hit the like button, and if you want to know when I'm posting videos, just click the little bell. Have a wonderful week with your families, and I'll see you again on the next one. Cheers.